all right welcome back to this wonderful channel where we bring you back to back updates and information as it is. in case you have not joined our social media handle what are you waiting for you are welcome back all of us of freedom all over the world i'm dropping the video direct this one is from Uwezu okay if you know Uwezu okay you will know that Uwezu okay has been um, one of the favorite actors of the olden days comedy uh, they were the architect of home comedy and family what happens in the village and everywhere you know as they be in the days of Ake and Popo, uh, Uwezu, okay, all those movies, uh, Ake De and the likes of them. Let me drop the video for you, make you see what's in that man they talk concerning Mazin and the Kano Ahmadike, one of Ndibo. Of course, voices have started to rise to speak for the man uh, because everybody is believing that his right is infringed. And if you look at it, Sandy Goho, who was there before him, who was there, in this struggle, uh, even Kano was arrested before Igo. Igo, Igo have been released, and up until now, uh, Kano has not been released. Just here from the horse's mouth, uh, from the horse's mouth, uh, that means say uh, make you carry your ear put for the horse mouth. <laughs> make I drop you the video, make you see I see the be my people. I'm not going back to spoon to copy again. Please, I joined. I need make case I join. No, me the guinea. We need make case I join. Ujitere <laughs> all right welcome back wonderful people you don't see us that one they happen uh that one they come from nanye always okay wow <laughs> uh, if you are there in the days of akede okwa and the rest of them uh, there were a lot of um nigeria movies uh, movies like akede where they were the bad ones in the village. Onyeze. If you watched Onyeze. 
uh, Uwezoke was one of the protagonists. He was one of the main actors who acted in that particular movie. Uh, Akede and Onyeze, and he played quite a wonderful role. Uh, he made that movie very funny and uh, unique. And the man is still in the game uh, up until now. Uh, he's still doing his MC and acting in other Igbo movies. But I, I don't know why Igbo movies are not going far, even though they are not they are going far. But you cannot compare them with the promotion of Korean movies, you know, something like that, Chinese movies, like Chinese Kung Fu, it goes round, like all these in Indian movies, Z-World. Well, I think maybe because Igbo people themselves has, you know, they have not been able to, you know, uphold their, their language. I think Igbo language is one of the best language in the world. And I believe that if Ndi Ibo will invest in this language, language promotion, encourage uh, the teaching of this language in our various institutions, uh, in Ibo land, in the southeast, and other places in the world, uh, where you have your children there, you take them to Ibo school, I think that uh, Ibo people have come to a point where they will be able to do this kind of thing. Because if you go all over the world, there is no place you will go in this world without finding an Igbo man. I think it's difficult not to find an Igbo man in any part of this in any part of the world. It it is difficult. All right, you don't see as they go. Always okay. They try to talk about the matter. So we say a concern mass nam the kind of Hamadike. One of them will say you don't tell whether they carry that man put for that place. Why they never want release him. Say that one, it don't too much for these politicians. We'll be saying that then they do this thing for this country. Uh, why would they, they carry the man, uh, go put them for there? They no one release them. Now, what's in what is okay? They talk about uh, the man, the para. Say anybody will hold small picking something. Say one hand go heavy, I'm saying go bring and down. And in the talk, say, uh, Say they carry man since they carry man and they can put for that place for that uh, DSS cost study. Say instead they are alive to now. Say that one show say that man uh, God destiny and uh, make you survive. Some people they say uh, they suggest say it be like saying that the same prophecy, the same thing where we say it happened to South Africa, uh, nine one happen again where. And uh, everybody thinks can they hard for South Africa that they persecute people. Uh, Nelson Mandela, they talk, they carry and put him for inside jail. Uh, he can't stay there for like 20 something years. After he said they come out, uh, he come, and so he come become the president of South Africa then. And that was a unique and historic one, and it's a heroic action too. Uh, that could be the case of Mazin and the Canada, that is what some people are suggestive, suggestive of. Uh, that's, uh, the case of Mazin and the Kano might be like Nels, that of Nelson Mandela. Uh, we go come out with freedom in his hands. Uh, but the question is, uh, it could it be that somehow uh, Mazin and the Kano will one day become the president of Nigeria? Uh, I'm just saying something. I am not concluding. I'm just putting a question for you. Uh, what if that Mazin and the Kanu becomes first Igbo president in Nigeria? What do you think? What do you suggest? Do you want it that way? You know, I'm just, let's say that something happened and, you know, one way or the other, he become the president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. Just like what happened to uh, Nelson Mandela. There are many people that are of, the, of this opinion that Mazin and Kano might not only, might not just be the savior of Ndibo, that it could be that he is savior of Nigeria. You know, somebody put forth these things to me, and, you know, I pondered. I started thinking about it. You know, I, you know the thing caught my attention that the person just said it that, we that everybody might be looking this guy called can he put it this way i'm just using my friend's words he said that everybody that 
that is looking at this canal might think that uh, this man does not have a bigger future. That can could become can may not be only the savior of their fans. Ndibo. That it may be that Kano is also the savior of Nigeria. That Kano might become the president of Nigeria one day. And that also, you know, this person was saying these things, and I, I was wondering, he said that also those who can see the future, who can forecast into the future, have forecast, and they saw his destiny, and that's why they started fighting him. But as the man was saying that people like Kano are like people like Nelson Mandela, that people you cannot destroy that no matter what you do to them that god almighty will still protect that even when you want to do them harm something will make you to just become friends with them <laughs> you know um something will make you to just become friends with them that's just it <laughs> so meanwhile uh, you know get us to be where never be before you know get us to be where never be before i say ojinula 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 uh, our people say that um chicken uh no oku sino if one a tilum babu kwanu konye jimu alapia uh no ko wa ye no nia e water go and so they be if I put them for English and if I convert them for pigeon for you, you mean say chicken they cry when kite one can call in child and the chicken say what you they cry for no before the kite where the kai in ch um pekin leave amo you say na make everybody hear what thing happen. Uh, in case anything happen, uh, you know, as they be, say, God, we be protector of this world, in go still judge every man. We say, uh, make today be fine for you. Uh, make today be palatable for you. Make today be good for you. Oh, yeah. Thank you, the mama.